I'd say frustrated is, is the main word I'd use for us. Um, we've showed we've showed some glimpses of being a good side, and um, for majority of the games we've been a good side for for 40 minutes. And um, you know, as as we know and as the fans know, um, you know, and as teams and that played us, it's uh, it's not good enough to play 40 minutes. You end up coming on the wrong side of the scoreline, and I think that's been the case the past few weeks. Um, St Helens half time it was 12 all, ended up putting 30 odd on us. Um, Leeds same six all. They did the same to us, um, and yeah, and Uddersfield was the opposite way around. We started terrible and then had a good second half. So I think um, we've got to get a bit of a, we've got a bit, a bit of consistency in our game and um, start knocking out eight-minute performances. Anyone that's been in in these predicaments before, and, you know, there's a lot of uh, experienced blokes here and they've been in that before. And I think the biggest thing is, as a team, we've got to stick together. Um, you know, especially on the field, I don't think you can. When people are making errors, whether it's you know they've made it four in a week or you know they've made four in four weeks, I think you can't get you can't get on top of them too much, and you've got to be um, certainly I think you've got to be a bit more supportive of, of players, and you know everyone's heads are going to be down with being getting beat, so um, to compact that and, and to get on top of each other and get on each other's backs, it'd, it'd be it'd be stupid really in my opinion. So I think a big thing as a team, as a bunch of players, for us to do is just stick stick tight and be a tight knit group as we always are, and we've we've always been like that no matter. What personnel we've had here at OKI, okay, it's always been a tight-knit bunch. I, I, I wouldn't say it's my best rugby, I think it's... Um, I don't know, I'm, not, I'm probably my own biggest critic, so the, probably the best person to ask is, is, is Sandy or, or one of the other players, but um, you know, I, I try to look at um, things that I've done good and things that I've done bad, and obviously try and do more of the good and less of the bad, but um, as I said, I've just tried to be consistent, and I think as long as I'm working as hard as I can, you know, every game and you know every tackle in every game, I'm trying to get there um, and you know, trying to do the right things off the field as well. That's a that's a massive thing. As long as I'm doing that, I should be there or thereabouts. We need to. Uh, I think we need to start on the front foot. We, too many times we've fallen behind in games and trying to trying to claw it back. I think uh, it's a big week this week. Bradford are going to be coming off all guns flying after the the big defeat to Huddersfield, so they're going to be they're going to be coming out with a point to prove. It's going to be a tough game, and you know, no game in this league is easy, and there's no easy team. So we're going to have to be, again, we're going to have to be at our best, and we're going to have to be, um, we're going to have to be completing well. I think our completion rates overall for the season are something about 60 odd percent, 68 percent, which is uh, which is certainly not good enough because as a professional team, you'd expect to be at least around 80 percent.